Okay, I decided we're gonna try something. We're gonna cook outdoors using the barbecue. I've get, got it preheated to around 400, but we're gonna use my uh, skillet. So here comes the train, just in time to start the video. There we go. So what I have here is some uh, green bell pepper and uh, some yellow onion. I have a little olive oil in the skillet. It's been preheating up there on the barbecue for about 10 minutes. So we'll just put them in there. I'm going to get them cooking for just a little bit, and then I'll go ahead and add that. Uh, this is our leftover pork rib from last night. We cooked in the Dutch oven. It was a slow cook. We cooked these for about two and a half hours. It's amazing. So I'm going to make breakfast with leftovers, so we'll see you back. Okay, let's see how these veggies are doing. Oh yeah, they're starting to sizzle up. So this is a four burner barbecue. I have these two burners on and these two burners off. That way if I need to adjust the heat any with my skillet, I can pull it one side to the other. See, that side's getting hot. So, kind of just, let's move it over a little bit that way. Yeah, that's smelling good already. Yeah, this, would, this is a great way to cook. I mean, if the power's out or if you have a barbecue, cast iron is the best. I mean, this is pretty dang good. So we'll go like that. And then I just this is just one of the country pork ribs we cooked in the Dutch oven last night. The video to this is in, a, in my video selection, so be sure and check that out because it was so good. But I thought it's been in the fridge, so... I want to get it warm enough and then we'll go to the next step. We're going to add some eggs once these veggies are done. So we'll see you back. Okay, I think we're ready. This is train number two since we started cooking. Yeah, they're moving some stuff today. But look at this. This has been cooking for probably eight to ten minutes just now that I pulled it on this side of the barbecue it's not directly over the flame so but look at those onions off the barbecue sauce just kind of that's pretty good so I'm gonna kind of group it together and then I have I just whipped up three eggs I usually put a little milk in my eggs but we don't have any just put that on there and this is gonna be great do that Give it a little pepper, a little bit of salt. Yeah, this is fun. Cooking on the barbecue outside. Love it. This is a little seasonal. So there we go. So we'll just cook that up. When the eggs are ready, we'll be ready to eat. I actually slid the skillet over the the fire the two burners that are lit to get those eggs going but man that cooked up great so let me grab the hot pad I'll sample this out yeah that is awesome yummy that looked pretty dang good all right look at that set that there. Let me shut these off. Let's give it a little taste. Here's the, I'm going to try, this is the pork rib. Mm. Yummy, it heated it all the way through, so I just cooked the veggies like you see for a little bit and then put the pork rib in there, but let's try it with some egg. That is good. Can't beat a breakfast like this, even when you use leftovers. Delicious. Yummy. There you go. Leftover pork ribs, eggs, little veggies. Do whatever you want. I hope you like this video. We'll see you next time.